So welcome to the cryptid corner. If you don't know what a cryptid is, it is an animal that has been claimed to exist, but never proven to exist. So Bigfoot, fog nest, stuff like that. So today we are going to do an Arkansas native, the Goro. It's this guy right here. <clears throat> so this isn't a very well known one. Super interesting to me though. I don't know why it's so interesting. It, my buddy described it as a lizard with a knife taped to its tail. So jumping into it, this thing, uh, the first stories of it came out in like the 1880s. Multiple reports basically saying um, one guy said that they killed one over in Searcy County, which is like a county over from here. And they sent it off to the Smithsonian the body of it they sent to the smithsonian him and a posse wrangled it up and then the smithsonian lost it which i've actually read some other stories where they sent stuff to the smithsonian and it was lost so it's like there's a whole nother smithsonian conspiracy <clears throat> crazy i don't know i might have to dive into that sometime because that's super interesting to me that they lose stuff so for reference, where is that? This uh, this other story says it was in South Arkansas, which on this map, uh, South Arkansas is nine miles north of me. So this one is a uh, very close. It's close to home here. So the other story is that these guys went out looking for the Goro found its cave, it came up behind them, and attacked them, and they barely escaped with their lives. And then there's an alternate ending that talks about a farmer saw this thing, and when the guys got to him, his hair had gone white because he was so traumatized from this. I, it was literally in the... Uh, <clears throat> like the Arkansas Gazette, like the big Arkansas newspaper. And I always see this cave when it comes to it. It's, it's said to have been in a place called Devil's Cave, Devil's Hole, Devil's Hole Cave. Um, I don't imagine it's like this. I imagine it's more like a well or like a hole in the ground, you know, um, which I've actually talked to a couple people in person that say they have seen this cave. Super interesting. Uh, the rumors are that the farmer <clears throat> blocked it up so people couldn't go into it. Um, that happens with a lot of caves here. That uh, that cows go falling into caves and stuff. It's pretty common for farmers to do the holes. I have talked to a couple people that have hunted in that area and have seen this this cave. Again, it's nine miles up from me. So some of the possible... Uh, explanations for this is they think it might have been like a razorback uh, like a, a hog basically stuck down in a hole and that's what they heard wheezing and yelling and stuff down there um, they said that they also dropped like a rope with some metal on it down and it bent the metal mm, I don't know um, there was also a possible explanation that it was a alligator I don't know about that one. We don't really have alligators this far north in Arkansas. But my the best one, um, the best explanation, it's lizard people. That is one of the explanations for this, that it is the hole, the devil's hole, is just a entrance into the lizard's people dominion. Which, if you don't know what the lizard people are, which it's a pretty famous conspiracy, it's basically that there are lizard people living under the earth, and they have their whole civilization. I don't know. It's crazy. I just found that one super interesting, though. So, the Arkansas local Goro. That is, uh, that is the cryptid corner for today. Super interesting.